Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new, I'm Kamala and this channel is about me restoring my health. Um, if you have not subscribed yet, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, share with all your family and friends. So today and for the next 30 days, I'm going to try the next 25 days because I started this on Sunday. Somebody asked me to document daily my struggles. Well, not, it's not that much of a struggle. Well, yeah, it is. Um, to get to drink one gallon of water a day. So I'm going to document how I'm doing it every day. So I had a late start this morning. Um, my little one had problems sleeping and then when he fell asleep I also have other projects working on so I was up for most of the night so I actually went to bed probably around 7 a.m. and then I got up at 11 and was answering some emails so I basically yes 11 45 now so I basically just rolled out of bed and I filled my water bottle and I'm also I also started taking this supplement um, let me find it I also started taking this supplement I'm gonna link it in the description um, and I think it's working wonders the the symptoms you're supposed to have when you're taking it I'm having them so I'm assuming that means it's working and you have to take it on an empty stomach so usually not by choice although i'm gonna start doing it by choice i usually eat between 12 and 8 and my first meal is usually between 12 and 3 and then i have another meal at 8. um so you're supposed to have this as a, on an empty stomach and i'm gonna probably have something to eat around 12 31 so i want to take this now because you're supposed to have it on an empty stomach and then wait um half an hour i think to two hours um so i try to wait as long as possible but also um i just fed my son as well but he's gonna be hungry again like probably in like two hours and i usually like to have a lactation smoothie because what one of the things i forgot to tell in my pregnancy story is they kept on telling me that i would not be able to breastfeed because i was extremely emaciated and i'm gonna try and figure out a way to add some pictures so you can see how much weight i had lost i had lost a lot of weight so i guess i look very frail um and they said because you know of my medical condition i would not be able to I probably won't be able to breastfeed so every time I would try to feed him they were saying you know it doesn't make any sense to try which is bad medical advice but I would not give up and instead of the third day my milk came in the second day and so far he has been exclusively breastfed we started solid but he hates it um, I tried to feed him as much as possible but he still prefers the breast so um, he's pretty much still exclusively breastfed with very 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 little solids when I can get him to take it so um, I try to take a I drink a lactation smoothie every day sometimes twice a day to make sure that my my milk supply stays up because of what they told me in the hospital I probably don't even need it but that's just me being paranoid I don't want my milk supply to ever decline so I'm gonna take, I'm gonna drink that smoothie probably like in an hour cause he's sleeping now but he'll probably be up in like two hours and he'll be hungry so I need to take this now so I'm able to drink that smoothie so here goes. Hold on I literally forgot to take the pill. So that what it, that's what it looks like and I got this particular brand because it this brand always has the best reviews there are cheaper brands out there but some of the brands have in uh, and you see, you see that on my lip my baby boy has been headbutting and he busted my lip yeah 
So um, there are other pills out there that um, have in soy um, and having other things, having soy and dairy. And if you are trying to shrink fibroids, you should not be ingesting soy or dairy. So if I'm gonna link it below, but if you're looking for it, also remember to look on the ingredients to see what it to make sure it's all vegan. So, as I said, my sister got me this bottle, which I love. This bottle is 32 ounces, which is brain fart. Four cups of water. <clears throat> and my goal is to have four of these a day. I love them because, see, it's easy to lug around everywhere. It's pretty much lightweight. And I mean, most people have two to four meals a day and then two snacks. So it's a good reminder to have one of these with each meal. And it's actually not easy to, it's not hard, sorry, to chug it. Um, what I usually do, I just chugged everything at once just now. But usually what I do is I do half before I eat and then I finish the rest when I'm done eating. So I'm going to link it again in the description box if you're interested in getting it. So that wasn't hard. It actually, just a little tip, it gets easier and easier the more that you do it. So it starts out it starts out hard. You might feel a little bit woozy because that's just because your body's not used to it. But just keep at it. It gets easier and you'll feel better. And especially when you start, your bowels start moving because it flushes out your body. There's a lot more space for the water and you'll feel much better. So when the when it, my next meal comes around i'll show you again that i'm drinking the water i'm getting it down hi guys and welcome back to my channel i did intend to video um every time that i drank one of those bottles but as you might hear i have my hands full with this cute little one um i did try but with everything else that i had to do it was impossible um, so today was pretty good though. Um, I feel a lot better. Um, I did have some pizza today though because it's Friday. It's Friday. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, so I had some vegetable pizza um, and full disclosure, the guy, the pizza guy said that someone had canceled their order. So he gave us a free pepperoni pizza as well. So I had a slice of that. Um, but other than that, I had my lactation smoothie and then I'm going to have some fruits in a little bit, even though it's late, it's like nine o'clock, but I feel like I didn't have enough, um, fruits today. So I'm going to have some fruits shortly. Um, so yeah, that was my day nutrition wise. One thing I must say about drinking so much water is you get, um, you feel full faster. So you don't eat as much. And as I said, I had lost a lot of weight while pregnant. I'm going to insert some pics right here. So this is before pregnancy. And this is during pregnancy. This is immediately after. And this is me now. I lost 75 pounds and that's the, the only, well, apart from my beautiful son, the other good thing that came out of that pregnancy was um, by the time I had given birth, there was not one ounce of fat. And after I was also very swollen. So when the swollen went down, I there was not swollen. one ounce of fat on my body. I didn't even realize I was that 
except for I had a belly, of course, but I didn't realize I was that snatched and toned and everything. I was looking good, but I thought I was too in the in the wor in in the words of my country, I thought I was too maga. That means too skinny. So I set out to put on ten pounds, which is easy. I just I have these um two shakes that I do every day so that I would gradually put on the ten pounds and I did put on the ten pounds. And then when I put on the ten pounds I was like, hmm, I think I looked better before. So I'm thinking of losing ten pounds. But let me know what you think. Um do you think I look better before or now? Should I keep on the 10 pounds? I know my sisters will comment. They think I should. Um, or should I lose the 10 pounds? Let me know what you think. But so far, so good. Um, it has been very difficult to record every time I drink water. So what I'll probably do is update every couple of days how it's going. Um, but so far, I feel much lighter the mass feels a lot spongier. Um, I like to dance by myself. Um, <laughs> I like to dance up in here, basically. Um, and I'm able to like whine. The Caribbean people know what I'm talking about. I couldn't whine before, I can whine now. So I would say that there is improvement, but I'll continue to update you. Um, to let you guys know how it's going and thanks for watching if you have not subscribed yet what are you waiting on come join the family and don't forget to like comment let me know how it's going for you if you're also on the water challenge and always remember to live by design bye